So now I, that you're <coughs> passing and you're doing good in everything, yeah. what are you thinking is going to be your choice about what you do in life? Um, when you're so good at everything, <laughs> what what then are you That's an interesting deciding one. about life? I've said this before. Mm -hmm. It was always assumed that if you're good at if you're good in class, you'll do sciences. Yeah. That it was assumed. Nobody asked nobody. Yeah. I, I look back and I say, my teacher expected it, my classmates expected it, the, the headmistress expected it, my mm. parents expected it. Mm. Everybody knew I was going to be a doctor. Mm. No one asked me, no one, and <laughs> I knew because it was like, yeah, if you're good at stuff mm. and you do sciences very well, then mm. you're going to be a doctor. Mm. So that pe people asking, me, do I regret being a doctor? I don't regret being a doctor, but I just find it odd that nobody ever bothered to ask me what mm. I wanted to be. Mm. They all assumed I was, was going to be a doctor. For you. Yeah. Everyone, everyone yeah. assumed I was going to be a doctor. Yeah. So I was there and I was good in history. I was good in geography. I was good in yeah. math, in English. I was yeah. good in physics, chemistry. Yeah. I think I did agriculture at some point. But somehow they knew that once I finish, yeah. they, they knew that once yeah. I finished secondary school, yeah. I was going to do sciences and then become a doctor. You would have been <clears> anything else if you would have wanted. Yes, I could have. Yeah. Yeah, I could have been anything, really. Were there other interests? I never thought about them because, it, as I've said, it was yeah. like predestined. Yeah. I was going to be a doctor. So I never thought, I never gave any other thing much thought. Uh, and so yeah. when I did my uh, secondary school, mm. I loved math. Mm -hmm. And math was not a subject for medicine. Yeah. Because if you wanted to do medicine, in high school, you do physics, chemistry, biology. biology. Those were the three subjects. Right. So when I came back in high school, for high school, mm -hmm. I told his headmistress, I want to do mathematics. Mm. And they say, no, you can't do mathematics. I said, I really, really want to do mathematics. Mm. And so one thing which, if you go to my alma at what they remember me for, I did four principles mm -hmm. in high school. Mm -hmm. It was, you could do four principles, but people used to pick like, uh, okay, do physics, chemistry, mathematics, mm. and then you pick something else like mm. Swahili mm. or like a language mm -hmm. or like um, Islamic studies. Mm -hmm. So they, they would pick things which are not considered academically mm -hmm. difficult mm. as your fourth subject. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Me, I, I chose physics, chemistry, mathematics, and biology. Mm. So all four. All four. And uh, so I think it was a record. Mm. And I think at that time, mm. it was very, very, very unusual <laughs> to do four principles mm. that included mathematics. With mathematics as the, uh, as the fourth one at as the, the fourth time. One. But I felt I liked math so much yeah. and there was no way I was going to drop to it. To let it go. Yeah. And um, the headmistress was very accommodating. She yeah. was a nun, yeah. a British nun. Yeah. Maybe that was why. Yeah. And uh, because... If you did physics, chemistry, biology, yeah. you are destined for the medical stuff. Yeah. And then if you did mathematics, you're destined for engineering. Yeah. Since it was unusual to yeah. do both, yeah. previously, if there was a math lesson, there would be a biology lesson. At because, the same time. At the same time. Because, because there, would be no there would be no one doing both. Yeah. So the whole time they had to be organized. Afresh. Reorganized because of you. Because I was doing oh, wow. both. Wow. <laughs> That's why I say she was so accommodated. She was so nice. Yeah. Yeah. So the whole time they had to be reorganized. Oh, it had never happened. That's because as I said, everything used to happen at the same time. So they certain records. Exactly. So they, they reorganized the budget. <laughs> I mean the timetable. The timetable. Mm. So I could do both subjects. Really nice. Really yeah. nice. And so Looking I, back <clears throat> many years, fifty mm. years later, no, no regret in terms of in terms of career path at all. None, 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 yeah, yeah. none. And uh, okay, but uh, I mean, be, yeah, sometimes you're young and and foolish, maybe. <laughs> so when it came to uh, now filling the application forms for the university mm -hmm. at high school, mm -hmm. I filled pharmacy. Okay. And um, because pharmacy was new. Mm. And maybe you, and maybe I was rebelling, saying like everybody thought I was going to be a doctor. Now mm. I'm not going to be a doctor. I have a, ch I have a, ch I have a chance to, to be something, something do different. something else. Yeah. Of course, pharmacy is in medicine, but still, yeah. I I put pharmacy. And then this very accommodative headmistress mm -hmm. said, "There's no way you're going to be a pharmacist." I said, "I want to do pharmacy." He said, "No, you're not going to be a pharmacist." And she wrote a letter to my dad, 
and said, you have to come to the school. Just imagine those days they would write a letter, post it, oh. and the letter would yeah. so eventually days. get home. Yeah. For my, my, we had the post office box, which yeah. was cool. Yeah. So it was easy to send things. Mm. And my dad used to come to the town where the school was quite frequently. Mm. So he picked this letter and immediately came to school. Mm -hmm. So they sat me in a room and said, you're not going to do pharmacy. Like you have to change your choice and put medicine. I was like, okay. So they say, think about it. I was like, what is there to think about? My dad is here, you're here. So, okay, bring <laughs> an eraser. I mm. erased pharmacy oh. and put medicine. Oh dear. And um, in, when I, in retrospect, I think they were right because yeah. Um, yeah. the headmistress said, if you become a pharmacist, the only thing you'll do is count pills behind the counter mm. the rest of your life. Mm. I was like, okay, that doesn't sound interesting. Mm. Of course, now there are more career options. Yeah, if you, if you do pharmacist. Yeah, if you do pharmacy, but at that time, really, it was a new course. Mm. I think mm. the pioneers were like two mm. years ahead of us. Mm. So uh, he said, no, uh, mm. do medicine. So I had, I got an eraser and mm. erased pharmacy mm. Mm. and filled medicine. Mm. And for <laughs> for different for viewers who probably might be struggling with the idea of secondary and then high school. In some places, high school is high school, then A-levels. So just that clarification yes, yes. Um, is, is important. So um, you do, you finish your high school, A-levels, then mm -hmm. you go to, for two years, then now you go do, you start medicine. Do you do medicine in Uganda still? Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah. Which university? So I went to Makere University. Okay. And. Um, for the record again, mm -hmm. <laughs> I think they had the last person to do medicine from my high school was like maybe five years before. Oh, so so they um, were doing other things. Yeah, they were like, um, yeah, people would sit high school, but opt for other things. none would not none would pass to do oh, medicine. It's not that okay. they would opt for it. Mm, mm. Uh, medicine, you had to have it as a first choice, yeah. and you had to pass very highly. Yeah, to, oh, that's to a go for good, medicine. Good record. So they, I know the person who was before me. Yeah. she was about maybe five years ahead. Oh, and so I, I, I go to medical school. Yeah, but I, I also look back and say that I could have done engineering if I wanted to yeah. because I'd passed enough to do engineering. I could have done architecture. I could have done. Pharmacy, I yeah. could have done almost all the um, courses I wanted to. Yeah. So it looks, it's, it feels good to feel, to say that I could have done anything I wanted to at that point in my life. Yeah. But yeah. I had done, I'd feel for medicine, so I could yeah. still do. Yeah. So as a, <coughs> yeah, as a late teenager, um, you have this wide area of, <laughs> of potential options, options, but, options, but it's medicine, which is what everyone has chosen for, but also what you're choosing. So yeah. Makere, here you come. Yeah. And and it's a six-year course so as well? Five years. Five, year five years in mm -hmm. school, and then you do one-year internship. Mm -hmm. 